when a software developer sits down to do an integration with some third party system, whatever it is, whether it's a, whether it's like a sales tax calculation service or shipping or anything, um, or payments, they expect to download a library to do it with. Like it, it, they expect to just drop a little configuration snippet in some kind of config file on their desktop and run a script and then poof, they have the libraries and they can start going. That's what they expect to have happen. Um, and that does not mean sign an NDA first, it does not mean get credentials to some portal and download it manually. That's that's not, that doesn't cut it anymore. You, they have to be able to download an SDK and the SDK has to be in all the usual spots that they would expect it to be. So if they're a .NET developer, that would be a Nougat. If they're an iOS developer, that would be CocoaPods. If it's Java, it would be Maven. If they're JavaScript, it's NPM. And so all of the blotch of SDKs work the way a developer who's aware of fairly modern programming techniques would expect them to be because we don't want to have to we don't want to have to be special things should just work the way everything else works and so that's how we designed it